So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in edit power plan. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on power options. And now you're gonna click on choose what the power buttons do. And then once this comes up, you're gonna click on change settings that are currently unavailable. Make sure you have fast or top ticked. You're gonna tick this and then click on save changes. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search and type in task manager. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on the startup apps tab. This will show you applications that are gonna start as soon as your computer turns on. So if there's any applications here that you do not wanna use that start up when your computer turns on, you want to disable that. So in my case, I've got Java right here that starts up automatically when my computer turns on and I know it does because under the status, it says enabled. So now I want to disable this. So I'm gonna click on it and I click on disable. And now Java will not start when my computer turns on. So just do that for the applications that you do not want to start when your computer turns on. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search and type in disk cleanup. Click on it. And then once this comes up, you're gonna select everything here and then click on okay. And then click on delete files. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on check for updates. Make sure your computer is fully up to date. And now for the next step, you're gonna head over to search and type in adjust the appearance and performance of Windows. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna select adjust for best performance. Now once you select this, everything will now be blank. Now you're gonna select custom. And now where it says show thumbnails instead of icons, you're gonna tick this. And where it says smooth edges of screen fonts, you're gonna tick this as well. So you're gonna untick everything and then tick both of these and then click on okay. And then once you do all of that, you should be good to go. You can just restart your computer. And yeah, that's how you do it.